Hey guys, so in the article Children's Mental Health, I was very surprised to know that there's 15 million children that have a mental health problem. The reason it was so surprising is because I don't think children should have to deal with abuse, violence, and other problems happening in their house. And I was also surprised to know that teachers think that the troublemakers are just simple troublemakers, but in reality, they're probably dealing with mental health problems, and that's why they act very aggressive and stuff like that. Also, I do believe that the schools have a responsibility to help children with mental health problems because, think about it, they spend more time than anyone else with those children because they spend about eight hours in school, meaning that teachers can pick up, you know, on patterns and anything that the child is dealing with. So they should have that responsibility to help children with mental health problems. Also, um, Another thing that I found very interesting was in the audio about the nurses, how children go to the nurse and pretty much like say that they have these problems, blah, blah, blah and they're just like patterns that nurses are picking up on because those children have mental health problems. So I believe that if we were to have a counselor, a psychologist, a nurse or anyone a child could look up to in schools at all times so a child can go up to them and talk to them about their problems therefore the child will feel safe and it will actually help them with their mental health problems because they're talking about what's going on in their house and if we're able to stop something now from becoming a bigger problem meaning like if you help a child right now that has a mental health problem in the future, they'll have a better future.